There are no Marquis of Queensbury rules in guerrilla warfare. It's a simple matter of kill or be killed, capture or be captured. In this phase of the instruction period, the student is taught the gentle art of murder, the technique of killing or crippling his opponent with his two hands at close quarters. The success of this system of close combat has little to do with size or strength. The larger man here should have little trouble tossing the smaller one around. Yet by the pressure of one finger in the right spot, he is rendered powerless. The same theory applies to all the holds in this course. Most valuable offensive blow at close quarters is the chin jab. The hand is held open at shoulder height, and the blow is delivered to the opponent's chin with all the weight of the body in the follow through. As the blow is launched, the knee comes up to the testicles and the fingers close on the opponent's eyes. If your adversary holds you up from the rear, turn away from the gun, falling into him. Pin his gun arm and lock it with your left, at the same time jabbing to his chin and eyes and bringing the knee up to his testicles. As he falls, go with him, keeping your knee in his groin. To disarm from the front, bring the left hand quickly across his shooting hand, grasp the pistol and deflect it toward him. Bring the right down and twist his wrist back, breaking it if possible. Follow through as usual, using the knee to complete the job.